All right, everybody, new at the Dallas Arboretum with an elegant name, what they'll be calling a tasteful place is opening this week. This is a 3.5 acre ornamental garden, pavilion and kitchen inspired by the move toward eating fresh and locally grown food. So let's talk about it because garden designer and TV host Pete Allen Smith helped to craft the new garden and create the programming there. Andy. Good morning. Well, uh, good morning, yes, and uh, he's here to tell us more and share his own uh, tasteful recipe for rosemary butternut squash. Yeah, it's the season, right? Right. Yeah, it really is. So I'm so excited about the Arboretum is opening, yes. the tasteful place tomorrow. This has been a while in the making. It too. has, it has. And, and it's, it's sort of, and tell us a little bit more, it's, it's kind of a revolutionary concept. Well, it is. It's, it's all about local food and all the kinds of things you can grow right here in this part of Texas. You can go there every day. They have tastings. So it's it's really going to be quite phenomenal. There's cooking classes that'll be going on, all kinds of demonstrations, just like the one I'm going to show you today. Yes, yes. we've got okay. a little cooking class of our own here. You know, they have 90,000 pumpkins at the Arboretum right <laughs> now, great. and these are just a few of them, and they're all edible. All right? Beautiful. Yeah, so look at this, and this is called the speckled hound, but what we're focused on is what everybody knows is butternut. So it's a really simple recipe. So what I've done is I've just cut the butternut squash into wedges, and then Jenny, it's a simple, uh, basic layered recipe with the squash in the bottom. And okay. we take Granny Smith apples and slices like this, and we just layer it with white onion, okay? Oh, mm. in interesting combination of flavors. They're, they're good, yeah. and they come together so beautifully. And it looks like a lot of white onion, but that, that will not overpower. It does thing. not. Right. It okay. does not, Dan, it, absolutely. So you take a little apple, uh, this is an apple liqueur, Calvados, or apple jack, as we call here, huh. then a little rosemary. I've not worked with a lot of that uh, apple liqueur. Oh, yeah, <laughs> all right. I, I think I, I need to. I think you do. Yeah. A little bit of garlic, then a half a cup of olive oil. Wow. Yep. And a half a teaspoon of pepper, a full teaspoon of salt. And so you make this and you just pour it over, just like this. And you let that marinate and you bake it in the oven at 350 for about 45 minutes. And voila, this is what you get when it comes out of the oven. You can create this. A, de a day ahead, pop it in the oven for guests. It is so delicious. You have me planning ahead for Thanksgiving already. Wouldn't that be a kind of a nice addition? And garnish it with just a little rosemary, and it makes a beautiful presentation on page 229 of my cookbook. Mm. Is mm. that, go is that cookbook going to be sold out there at the Arboretum? At Arbor the Arboretum. Arbor you yeah. better okay. believe it. I'll be signing it. I'll be there on the 15th doing a cooking demonstration. We invite everybody to come out, and I'll be signing books there. So you'll do the cooking demo, and then people can kind of just come through, sign up for that, and enjoy. Yeah, yeah. exactly. I, I do love this description that we were talking about, the tasteful place. Yes, it is good. Yeah. Uh, draws on age-old European gardening principles and artfully arranged features, including <laughs> an orchard, picnic lawn, yes. patios, and walking trails. We're growing all kinds of herbs in our potagers with beautiful vegetables. Vegetables can be both tasteful and ornamental. Uh, potagers? I'm uh, sorry, could you ask me, what is that? The potager, it was meant the idea of you bring anything in to put into the soup, the soup pot. Ah, yeah. okay. It goes See? way back. Wow, we're really going upscale this morning. Uh, <laughs> this at. is true. You have elevated the level of class here on Fox <laughs> Which, Well, wait till you see the Arboretum. This is nothing. It is yeah. fabulous. A Tasteful Place is the newest addition to the Arboretum, and I've, we've been so excited to be a part of its design and programming. I mean, the Arboretum is already a treasure and so popular. This is going to take it to the next. I mean, people oh. are going to go crazy for this. I, I yeah, predict. They can eat there. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Hey, Alan Smith, exactly. thank you so much for coming in. And I want our viewers to remember that you can try out that recipe. You can class up your own home with the locally grown stuff. It'll be on our website, fox4news.com, and we'll be right back.